Hill, a volunteer with Furry Friends Rock and Rescue, as well as Connor, a recent adopter. So good morning, both of you. Thanks for coming on here today. Good morning. Good I morning. don't know. Good morning. I don't know if we've ever had guinea pigs on the show before. So, <laughs> um, what other types of animals does Furry Friends Rock and Rescue offer? Because I thought I it was knew cats it. and dogs. I knew it, guys. You do it. Fine. We'll get to you in a second, Connor. <laughs> so we have taken are... in. Any animal that we can find a foster for. So okay. we've had lizards. Oh, oh, hold on here. <laughs> well, I know you're excited. <laughs> we've had lizards, we've had snakes, we've had rats, I know that guinea pigs, snake. chinchillas, ferrets, cats, dogs, turtles. Um, anything that we can find someone in the community willing to house for us, yeah. we will rescue. Okay. Um, that's kind of kind of what yeah, we're here for. <laughs> need. There it really is. And you got a lot of cuteness, as I always describe, as described here. So guinea pigs. Yes. Connor, I know you're anxious. We're going to you. You are a recent adopter of a guinea pig. Tell me uh, a little bit about your guinea pig. My guinea pig is love to exercise. Love to exercise. And eat. And eat. Do you What's have her name? To... Um, Speedy. 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 Yeah, Speedy is a different animal. It's a guinea pig, right? That's a guinea pig. Of Why did you toy. want a guinea pig? Because I love guinea pigs. You love guinea pigs. We love that answer. And so you adopted, you helped out Furry Friends Rock and, Re Rock and Rescue. And uh, then Starla, where, what is the need for guinea pigs here? You have a couple that you brought in. Yep, too. so these three came in together. Um, someone had the three and could no longer care for them. Mm -hmm. So one of our fosters volunteered to step up and take them into her home. So we have Mulate in my lap. Um, Mulate. <laughs> in the front of the pouch, you can see Smorio and then Beans, the black and white, is kind of hiding in the background. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of people tend yeah. to take in small animals like this. They get them from Pet Smart or yeah. Petco or whatever small animal pet yeah. shop um, and they but realize there's responsibility that comes with these small animals they need a lot of care attention mm -hmm. they take responsibility and finances just like any other pet mm -hmm. so um, a lot of rescues are finding that small animals are being surrendered at a higher rate than you might expect would you say they're easier to maintain like a, than a dog or care for or? Um, I think they need maintenance in different ways yeah. their nutrition is very specific their care is very specific but you know you don't have to run a guinea pig for 45 minutes yeah. a day you need to to monitor their diet you need to get them out for some play and some companionship every day mm -hmm. but they're probably a lesser time commitment than yeah. a bigger animal <laughs> do you walk your guinea pig yeah do you walk your guinea pig yeah yeah what do you feed your guinea pig for food lettuce, lettuce? yeah well, well that's a good healthy lunch option um, how many times a day do you feed your guinea pig a lot of times. So, so they're, yeah. they're work, but they're not work is kind of what I'm yeah. learning. Yeah, but they're fun and sweet. They really are. Now, do they run around a lot more or are they just kind of off guard here with all of the lights? Um, it depends on the guinea pigs. So yeah. they're prey animals. They tend to be pretty defensive, pretty yeah. internalized, but once they get comfortable with you, they can be very social and much more active. Uh -huh. um, they do actually need a, a pretty large enclosure so that they have room to move around, mm -hmm. chase balls, play with each other, play with toys. Um, but yeah, definitely this environment is a little scary for them. Right, Hi, totally honey. get that. Intimidating, we're all intimidated, yep. right? Connor, where do you keep your guinea pig? Is it just running around in your room? Does he have like a little hamster cage or anything? Mm, or? No, big Okay. A bigger cage? Yeah, it probably is a bigger yeah. cage. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, why did you want to have a guinea pig over a, ha uh, a dog or a cat? Was there any reason? Did I you get the pet? All of them. <laughs> you want all of them? Yeah. All the pets for Connor. Yeah. Yeah. So we can we can set you up, buddy. <laughs> all sorts dog of things. His name. So there. Oh, we got a lot of animals going on here. So <laughs> one more time, where can we adopt our guinea pigs and Furry Friends Rock and Rescue? Furry Friends Rock and Rescue, if you go to our website, you can actually sort our available animals by species, by age group, um, anything you're looking for. So if you're looking for a guinea pig, we've got eight of them right now. Okay. I think a ninth coming in maybe in the next week. Oh, um, you can search for kittens. You can search for puppies. Yeah. All of that is available on our oh, website, what? furryfriendsrockandrescue.org. Yeah. Well, thank you for coming down to Starla and Connor. Appreciate it. You're such a good guest. <laughs> thank you for having us. <laughs> thank, you. Hey, thank you, Connor. Me too. Thank you. <laughs> Keep it here. We're